Hey, you know, he's my dad. Sure. Race works for my dad. I did see him talking to Dr. Zinn the other day, but he throws like a girl. Bumblebee, is that you? Oh my gosh, it was so amazing. I'm freaking out that you were so cool to see everyone from that monster. I can't believe it! Don't you mean you and your new friend? No, I, I get it. I get it. The first rule of Robot Fight Club is you don't talk about Robot Fight Club. What you need to understand is that I don't want a bunch of crazy talking vehicles following me around trying to get me killed. There really is no fathoming the depths of my hatred for this place. I thought my life was boring in the Fire Nation, but this place is unbearably bleak. Nothing ever happens. Okay. You know there are many other worlds out there, besides your castle and this town, right? They've been secret, because they've never been connected. Until now. Its pages are scattered everywhere. Too many worlds. Those were my thoughts exactly. Two. No, no one. Okay. Two. Or three. Three. Uh, unless three is too much of an improvement. I'm sorry, is one is one in the mix still? Growing up, we were taught that the Fire Nation was the greatest civilization in history. And somehow, the war was our way of sharing our greatness with the rest of the world. They don't see our greatness. They hate us. And we deserve it. What the fuck am I doing? Well, apparently now I'm playing community games. Because I'm that much of a fucking asshole. If I'm gonna die fucking, uh, like 10, 20, or 4... 4,376 times, then at least I will die 4,376 fucking times listening to some decent goddamn music, not fucking a bunch of fucking fairies hanging around a goddamn heart, fucking Cupid fucking strumming and shooting out arrows and people's assholes and shit. Fuck that shit. We're gonna play this shit hardcore and I'm gonna yell and scream at it like a stupid motherfucker. Ball sacks. Huh? You know that guy, that guy from yesterday? He had on one of these. Oh, I want to see him again. I just have to. What's that? I think I'd better go take a look inside. But Ven, you are in danger here. Go wait in your- I don't know. Why isn't Ven here? Master, I best be on my way. Of course, I would never let that happen. I promise you I will bring Terra back. Only this time, you'll see he has what it takes to be a master. The school's paying for this, so the only tip I'm giving you is find a better job. I believe designer water was included. I'm not even hungry, but if the school's buying, I'm eating. You guys seem cool too. <sighs> but as you can imagine, I'm really tired. So you two should probably get going. I carved it in this tree years ago, long before you two rascals started squatting here. But seriously guys, thanks for keeping the place warm for me. Like, really great, thanks. You may be big, but you ain't bad. The boulder's gonna win this in a landslide. The boulder feels conflicted about fighting a young, blind girl. The boulder's over his conflicted feelings, and now he's ready to bury you in a rock -a -lance. Hey, look him up. Oh, it's under so crates. That's us, dude. Yeah. Now what? All we are is dust in the wind, dude. Mr. Pilgrim! Matthew Patel. Consider our fight begun. Perfect! I can see all the way across the tides of time. I'll be all right. He'll come and save me. No, I wish to go back to my sea. Ah! <laughs> I'm so excited! This isn't fair. This is cheating. I can tell by your eyes that you don't like fish. <laughs>